Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Master Shah Dao Center in London's Wednesday afternoon's Facebook Live. My name's Hina, and I am super excited to tell you about a very, very um, really looked forward to workshop that the center is holding this coming weekend, October 30th and 31st, called The Spiritual Way to Financial Abundance. Um, we also actually have an intro night tonight, and the links will be posted in the description. And um, so what is this workshop about? So I will just give you a very short uh, taste of what everyone is going to be um, learning this weekend. Uh, so far, we have over 170 registered participants so please 170 people cannot be wrong there must be something that we're teaching that you can't get anywhere else so so really consider it so basically um with dr and master jigong shah his main niche is basically um healing he heals on a spiritual level, our financial conditions, physical conditions, emotional, mental conditions, relationship conditions, and how has he found the tools um, not only to offer us this healing, but also teach us how to self-heal ourselves? Well, it is based on a basic principle that all his years of studying multiple uh, varied modalities from Western medical science, to um, traditional Chinese medicine, to learning the ancient arts of Qigong, Kung Fu, Feng Shui, uh, the I Ching, there's so many, um, by studying with Taoist masters, Buddhist masters. Um, he basically has become a grandmaster of several, several different modalities. So it's not just an expert in one area, he is literally an expert in multiple areas. And he has found the common thread. And once you do that, you can pretty much follow the thread and figure out a way how to transform it. So his basic teachings, which we're gonna go through um, more in detail over the workshop, but the basic teachings of what we experience in life, whether it's positive or negative experiences, is based on the law of Shen Qi Jing. So I'll just write it out real quick for you. So for us in our life, it doesn't matter if you believe in multiple lives. You can just focus on this lifetime if you'd like. Everyone can pretty much agree that what, however we live in life, we have a specific type of personality or we have our view, our opinions, our view of looking at things, our perspectives. And basically that is... Um, that's just common knowledge that I know no one's going to really uh, worry about. G and J, okay. And so basically it is the same thing with finances. Just like in every aspect of life, there's a root cause. Master Shah has found that the root cause is the Shen or the information. So we can say, so we can say soul, if you'd like, you can use the word information. You can use whatever word you have an affinity with. It's just a label. Basically, we're talking about the same thing, the root, which goes into the heart, which transfers into the mind. So the, the information is received by the heart, and the heart then sends it to the mind, which processes it, which then sends it to the chi or the energy, which actions it down to the manifestation level. This is where all the information is manifest, or in other words, matter. And so basically, whatever we have on our root level will filter down to what we experience in our life. So let's, if we have an attitude of abundance, our attitude will be in our heart and mind level, and it'll filter down to our physical level and we will see it. And the thing is, is that even though the root is the soul and slowly then it's received by the heart, processed by the mind, the energy actions it and it physically manifests on the matter level, there is also a feedback kind of um, loop because also what we, what we have on our matter level 
also can affect our energy and all the way up our mind or attitudes. So if we've grown up in a household where there's a lack, where um, our parents tell us money doesn't grow on trees, or this is the position in our life and this is exactly where we're going to be, that's on a manifest level. And when we grow up in that type of environment, that's what we'll cycle. That's what we'll continuously manifest in our real level in our uh, physical level. So even though the root is here and it filters down to our physical level, there is a slight feedback loop as well. So what we've experienced in our matter level can also go backwards. So that's an important thing to um, also understand with all this. Now, some people will, will have these type of mental attitudes about money or when they think about finances, their heart will close. So the mental attitudes about money is on the mind level. When sometimes you get stressed or like, oh, I have to pay this bill. Or it's the first of the month, I have to pay my electricity bill. The rent's due the first week. And you feel that in your body, that's the heart level. So you're, so you're feeling your attitudes. You're feeling your negative beliefs, your attitudes. And basically, um, on this level, it does filter out. So every first of the month, you're going to feel that feeling where you feel that tightness in your heart, like, oh my gosh, it's the first of the month, I have to pay the bill, or I have to pay the rent, I have to pay um, whatever, whatever's due on the first of the month, almost all the bills are due in the first week. And that's on that's in our heart level, because we feel that tension, we feel that stress, and that's not a nice feeling. Whereas there's some people in the world, where for them to pay a bill, or to even think financially, for them, their heart actually opens, they get that excitement where they want to create, they want to find a way to make money, they're entrepreneurial, or they want to create something new, something that the world needs. And for them, that's heart expansive because they get excited about it. They're the type of people who will stay up all night working on their project. And eventually, um, most of those people, because they've seen successes over and over, will continue to manifest those successes. So how do we change what's your main information what's your main warehouse filled with in regards to finances to abundance it's either going to be more positive or more negative and whichever way it is it all filters down so for those people who want to have more abundance they want to fill their house their warehouse with more positive information Master Shah has also found techniques to do this. So not, o not only do we know why, okay, I'm not doing that great, my job isn't paying me so much, or um, you know, I can't seem to find a better job or get more money. Master Shah has found several different techniques in how to transform whatever we have on the negative soul and heart level, even mind, transform it to positive, and then it filters down to our manifestation. And that's what we want. We can think and fantasize about that yacht or that mansion or that um, amazing bank account. But if we can't manifest it, what's the point? So all those people who are into law of attraction, who try their best to keep manifesting using creative visualization, even with them, when it comes to fully manifesting it, it gets stuck. So there's somewhere a, a, along this that's not fully opening them to that success that they want. And most of the time, it's because it's up here. It's on the soul or heart level where the warehouse of positive information regarding finances isn't strong enough or not enough. So I will quickly just introduce to you three different techniques that gets that Master Shah has found that gets to the soul level, which helps us transform our negative information to positive. And that's the beautiful thing with working with Master Shah, his leading teachers, and here in the Master Shah Dao Center is that you never get bored. You have several types of different um, practices you can do to help this one aspect of life. So one of the one of the 
most important practices that Master Shah teaches with any aspect of life is something called forgiveness practice. And you can find out more in this book written by Master Shah, Master Cynthia Devereaux, and Master David Lush. It's called The Greatest Forgiveness. And in this little book, it gives several practices for any aspect of life. And in here, there is a secret that Master Shah has revealed, the way to transform finances and business. So, um, so you can use this book and I'll just read this one sentence. I am delighted to release another sacred and secret wisdom to transform finances and business. And then he goes on to say, there's a sacred area located in our body that is responsible for this aspect of life. So um, maybe we'll do this practice for two or three minutes um, before I end today. Another form of um, soul healing that Master Shah has introduced is called um, Tai Tao calligraphy. So this specific calligraphy is called Da Chang Shang, and it basically means greatest flourishing. And with this one, all you have to do is follow the path that Master Shah has written, because in this calligraphy, it is embedded with secret codes that as you trace it, the positive information in an invisible form is actually changing this level right here and the soul level. And the more you trace this specific calligraphy, because it's for this specific aspect of life, you ask, you talk to it. It's like a living, it's actually a living type of entity that it can trans transfer the positive information from this into your soul level. So this is another technique and which we will learn more and we will practice together in the workshop this coming weekend. So that's another one. Then just to give you another type of um, practice that Master Shah gives, that this is his other, um, this is actually his most recent book. This is the Tao Calligraphy Healing Field, an information system with six sacred techniques to empower you to heal and transform your life. So in this book, he also gives a practice, and it's actually an interactive practice to heal and transform your finances or business. In this book, there's a link which you can go to online on your computer, and you can actually practice with Master Shah's voice on an animation for finances. And actually on that link, it also gives you a way to practice for your spiritual body, mental body, emotional body, and physical body. So if you don't have this book, please get this book. This book is amazing. So in just the short few minutes, I have given you three very effective techniques or hints that you can start using to transform your finances. Now, one reason that it's always good to join our live workshops is because we have a group field. We have right now at this point, we have over 170 registered participants and the number is just going to keep growing. And the reason you always want to be as much as you can in a group setting is because when you're in that group setting, the consciousness of each individual focused on improving their, their finances or transforming business, whatever um, type of aspect they're looking for, when each individual is giving their 110% in being in the field, which is the Dow Calligraphy Healing Field, which is behind me at the Master Shah Dow Center here in London, the results the power, the effectiveness, everything is exhilarated at a huge, huge degree. So you can practice on your own, 100%, please practice on your own. Everything is yin and yang, just like we practice in a group, we also have to practice individually. So definitely practice in your own. But when you're in a group setting with just under 200 people, can you imagine how quickly 
the practice, the same amount of time that you spend in a practice with two or 170 other people in the Tao calligraphy healing field compares to just practicing by yourself. It's like going to a class in the gym. When you're there in person, you try harder, you feel that group energy, you, you get more effects and you actually feel happier and better a lot quicker. So please join us. Um, I think you will be pleasantly surprised to what you can actually gain. So just to finish this little part where um, Master Shah has said, where's the secret energy center in our body? So if you don't have this book, also get this book. Because these books, he's made it so easy for us. All we have to do is read the invocation, do the practices, and we get the results. It is called the Lower Dantian. The Lower Dantian is a fist-sized energy center and is centered two to three inches below the navel slightly closer to the front of the body than to the back. So using the lower dante and that energy center, you can do the practice in this book to transform your finances. Now in just under, I don't know how long I've been on, about 15 minutes, I have already told you so many secrets that Master Shah has found. So can you imagine what you can actually learn in a two day workshop? So the two-day workshop will be taught by uh, master teacher David Lush and Meyer Shaw. And both of them are actually quite well versed in Master Shaw's practices. They bring with them their own empowerments, their own authorities that Master Shaw has, has um, empowered them with. And when you're doing a group practice with over 170 people, with two very powerful teachers leading it, all the effects from that practice will come sooner. It'll be more powerful and your finances will be transformed. So I thank you so much. If you could please leave a comment or share this video with anyone who is struggling with finances or is open-minded enough to try something that can actually work, please forward it to them. Thank you, Parvana, and thank you, Arthi. Thank you, Lucy. I see Lucy each time. Thank you, Lucy. So please share this video. Let people know about the Master Shah Dao Center here in London, because at the end of the day, we just want people happier and healthier. So I thank you so much. My name is Hina, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.